and the Victoria 90 of Steve Jabke will start from the tail. If you've only just joined us, Jack Bell in that four car, DNF'd his first round heat race. This should be a beauty, Benny Swanson, rattle them off mate, same rules apply, 10 laps the distance, this is heat 6 for the 500. Absolutely, with thanks to Warnable Powder Coating, we see heat race number 6, they creep up to the line and away they go. Ryan Hicks gets a good start, but up the inside we see the 71 of Dylan Beveridge, we've got to fail to launch here again for Jack yes. Bell. This is a story really starting to... Uh come out here at the moment and uh, issues Heart heartbreaking comes to mind captain Gary. obvious yeah. up in the box there it's a story and a half gary we're just here to have fun and get some laps in um unfortunate but uh we'll keep keep digging it will be more fun than right now trust me when i say that as jack bell sits this one out ryan higgs the west aussie the mps tree services seven and kurt dunham professional snooker player would you believe Oh, Ash Clements grabs a fistful of throttle and we stay green. What has happened here in heat race number six is Higgs and Dunham. They wage battle for the lead and give it to Higgs. Dunham is mighty as Chris Bellman. Oh, you want to be careful. That middle groove is a little slick. Top and the bottom is where it's at as we are yellow. Amber lights are on, I believe I there's some debris on the circuit here on the main straightaway. Something's come off that car uh, that we've seen head infield, so that's what they've uh, found here in the front straight. Oh, it's a torsion bar. Yep. It's an entire torsion bar and stop assembly. And I believe that's off the Ash Clements number 41. Well, eagle-eyed is our officials here at Hatesbury Stock Feed Simpson Speedway, so we're not going to I still am shaking my head. Green flag goes yeah, that up. That happens. Go, Benny. Take him away. Sorry, Once mate. Once again, nine laps on our line. S Steel Fabricators lap counter. Off the front with Ryan Higgs in the WA7. And he leads them up nicely. Heads off Kurt Dunham. Chris Bellman sits back in third. Further back we go to Dylan Beveridge, who's uh, looking to try and close in on the three leaders. But the front runner, the WA7 of Ryan Higgs, just coasting at the moment out in front. Kurt Dunham, he's going to come under some pressure now from Bellman up the inside through turns one and two. Bellman takes up second. We now go back to uh, further back to Dunham back in third. Beveridge in fourth. Pocareri back in fifth. Cameron Janke back in sixth. Up in front, your race leader though, is the WA7, who's looking comfortable out in front. Bellman looking to try and chase him down in second. Out in third, we see the 71 of Kurt Dunham. He's coming in at the reaches now of the Tasmania 71 of Dylan Beveridge. So the two 71s are locked together. Pocareri back there in fifth with the 64 of Cameron Janke. Further back to Matty Belcom, but up in front, your race leader. Higgs looking the goods out in front. Down through one and two he goes once again. Half race distance. There'll be four to run when he goes by this time round. And Ryan Higgs looking comfortable out in front. The West Aussie leads Chris Bellman in the Victoria 31. We go back to the 71 car there of Kurt Dunham. Further back to the 71 of Beverly. Beverage rather has gone past Dunham. Dunham is actually back in fourth, but Dylan Beveridge, he's worked his way to a comfortable position. The 71 car now has come to a stop of Kurt Dunham, so he's got some drama. But up in front, your race leader, the seven car, which is that of Ryan Higgs. Got two laps to run. Bellman looking to try and close the gap down. Having a bit of drama trying to do it at the moment, but Dylan Beveridge sits a long way back in third. The white flag goes out for your race leader. And the WA7 of Ryan Higgs leads it. The lead's not as comfortable as it has been. Bellman's coming strong in the last couple of laps. Can he throw something down through three and four? He has a go. Higgs will hold on in a thrilling finish as Bellman throws everything at him. The Tasmania 71 of Dylan Beveridge back there in third from Josh Pockery. In fourth from Cameron Janke, Matty Belcom, Angus Campbell and Steve Jadke. Something went amiss for uh, Kurt Dunham there in the last few laps in the Victoria 71. But uh, great drive from the WA7 of Ryan Higgs. Long way to haul from WA. 
but he gets the chocolates in the opening heat of round two. Gee, Chris Bellman looked racy too. Shame Certainly for did. Kurt Dunham because that black 71 was very good. Dylan Beveridge got by him for third there at one point as Ryan Higgs pulls.